Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. Today I'll be showing you guys how I made this full lace closure wig. So if you want to figure out how to get this, just keep on watching. So along with your hair, mannequin head, thread, and scissors, you're going to need a dome cap and some T-pins. The first thing you're going to do is put the dome cap on the mannequin head and then you're going to secure it in place with the T-pins. In here I made a mistake. You see how I'm pulling the dome cap far over the forehead and over the eyes of the mannequin? You don't want to do that because you have to sew the closure on first. So you're about to see me readjust it and pull it back some just by the forehead. And then afterwards I will re-pull it down over the forehead again. <laughs> now you're going to place the closure against the cap. But make sure you pull it forward just a little bit and then secure it in place. Now you're going to begin to sew the closure onto the dome cap, but as you're sewing, make sure you stitch close together. You don't want big gaps in between each stitch, I guess. So just make sure you stitch close together. And I don't want to talk throughout the entire video because I'm pretty sure it's kind of annoying. So I'm just going to let you guys sit back and watch what I'm doing. And
Once you get about an inch and a half from the closure, you're going to stop where you were and then we're going to start sewing the next piece of hair to the actual closure. And as I said, when we were sewing the closure down, you want to make sure you sew with your stitches close together. Since this is going to be right at the top, you want to make sure it lays flat and seamless. And just in case y'all were wondering, this is a completely new day, which is why I have on new clothes and a different wig. But yeah, it's just a new day. Now that we're done, we're going to cut the excess dome cap off. So I'm just going to follow the traces of the thread that I did. Make sure you don't cut too close because you don't want to unravel the entire closure. So just make sure you cut far enough from the thread but close enough so that you won't see the black through the lace. And once you cut that off, this is the finished product. So if you guys like this video and if it was helpful, 
make sure you give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and i will see you guys in my next video bye dolls